Владимир Владимирович, здравствуйте. Я студент и учусь в Санкт-Петербургском государственном университете. Until you reply, we have another video on the same topic. Quite impressive. Let's have a look at this video. Mr. President, good afternoon. I am a student and I study at the St. Peter uh, Institute. Do you have a lot of twins? And another point, what is your attitude towards the dangers fraught with the neural networks and the artificial intelligence. So he did not introduce himself, this person from St. Petersburg. <laughs> oh, well. <clears throat> I see. You can talk like me and use my voice, my pitch, but I figured that only one person could speak like myself and use my voice, and this is going to be me. It was a joke by one of our political figures. As regards the AI, well, whether we should fear the AI or not, preventing the, the advance in the artificial intelligence, including artificial general intelligence, detecting smells and having senses, and possessing the cognitive capability, being able to auto study. is impossible to prevent that. Unless we can prevent it, we should head and lead the process. We should be among the leaders in this domain. No one knows, however, where shall we end up. This is the reality of today. So we can talk about restrictions and self-restrictions, and we should come to terms, I mean, among the leaders, to prevent us from lapsing into some dangerous situations for the humanity when the nuclear energy was weaponized as a nuclear bomb and uh, everybody became aware that the threat was increasing and the damage would be unsurmountable, unacceptable. They started coming to terms, so same will happen, I think, to the AI when the leaders in the sector will grasp that it's dangerous, there are some perils, they will start negotiating. But prior to that, no one will hardly uh, attain any, any, any accords. Mm -hmm.